In all probability, it won't come to much, but who knows? <laughs> A small group of riders are trying to get clear of the bunch. This climb features some dreadful percentages. Attacked by Gujar. The lead rider is now more than two minutes ahead of the peloton. There's an attack in the group at the front. Betancourt is off. A couple of teams have set themselves up as pacemakers for the pack. They obviously don't have anybody in the breakaway group. Some team managers mustn't appreciate the fact that there is a breakaway, given that the pack has increased its speed. The lead over the pack is dwindling. The breakaway is not to everybody's liking. The peloton has significantly increased its speed. Some riders are being left behind. This climb is feared by many riders. The percentages are very high. Oh. 
Falling behind! A team leader is falling behind! The pack is back on level terms with the breakaway group. We can see that the pack is increasing the pace. It's going to be difficult to break away now. Only a few riders are capable of following the very fast pace up front. It's in such percentages that the strongest can create some gaps. We've got 15 kilometers to the finish line. The pack is increasing its work rate. Some teams can't be happy with the breakaway. Ten kilometers remaining. We're into the last five kilometers.
And there goes the mad burst for the final sprint. Watch out, a team leader is falling behind. The riders are in a portion above 10%. Victory right on the line! A real show of power! We're waiting for the back markers who appear to be fairly numerous in this difficult race. And here are the key moments of the race. Thank <laughs> you. 